Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Somebody <laughs> call me who I'm leaving. <laughs> Oh my god, you lot don't know what the hell's been going on. Yes. This has been the... Percy lost his mind. He lost his mind. He lost his mind. He lost his mind. Oh, fucking hell. I saw even do who my name is. You know it started. <laughs> we started hurting. Yeah, we started. What's this? What? <laughs> Alright. Um. <laughs> We've got a, a special guest coming on. As you on. can see, the clothes are traditional for this guest. You know what? I'm not going to lie to you. When I saw you coming there with that 30-year-old shirt, I said, what? <laughs> <laughs> but the thing you have up with Ben Moxie, though. I said, <laughs> no, this is clean, tailor-made. You don't know about Machino Casino. Chris, they are not... Listen, they used, to do, they used to do the trousers to that as well. Yes, I yeah. want that too. Yeah. <laughs> You got those trousers to Check go Check my old videos, branches. Really, Are you right? serious? Obviously. Did you have to get, be honest stuff. with me, did you have to get the bottom taken up? I did. <laughs> I did, I did. Fire that. This guy, you know, what is wrong Did you have to show the trousers? <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, yeah, I did, I did. And I did. what about the shirt as well? Same thing. Because remember, back in the days, yeah, people used to wear their things baggy. Yeah. Yeah, so I've tailor-made all of these. These are all old stuff. But this is a classic. Remember the machinos? Yeah? You didn't even know. You, the man might have been too old. You, you, to be old. You know about khaki? No, I know about Carl Carney, Gravity. Um, all of them thing there. Chris. Spliffy. <laughs> Do you remember Spliffy? No. That's your, no, that's not my age group. <laughs> that's not like your Bridget made that in his yard. You got a Spliffy. <laughs> Trying to tell me that was a big brand. I never heard of that in my life, you know. This time it's my brother from Brixton that made he made two tops in his whole career. <laughs> Chris is looking at you have your slipper yet? You have your slipper. I got my slipper. You have your slipper. No, they were big brands back then. Never heard of that. Machine. Eight ball. Yeah, eight ball. You don't remember eight ball jeans, brother. Chris, you don't remember eight ball jeans, brother. I'm what, what, what did the sign look like then? It was like a ball and an eight. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> it was. I, I, got, I got something big, man. I got something big. Like, I got the, the gums, you get me? But wait, did you tailor this? So this was like baggy before. Yeah. And then you had it taken in. Tailor it to my I'm going to look like it fit all right, you know? Look goody. All right, take, let me try it on and see what it look like on a real man. You want to try it? <laughs> <laughs> let me, let me try it on, actually. <laughs> Have you got your mic on there? Oh, you got your mic on I there? I got my mic on there. Oh, no, I've got to try this no, on. No, we got to try this Let me this see what this looks like. All right, let's so try this, it. This will be funny. Let me let's see this. Cameraman. <laughs> Man, I put on next man clothes. Oh, for like... fuck's sake. <laughs> you see what I'm going to some... Come on. No, I'm just trying to see how it fits first. Calm down. <laughs> just, just relax. Everything got to be homophobic with you. Really. <laughs> Listen up, me just say, man, I wear next man clothes. I'm not wearing it. I'm trying it on. I'm just, just, I'm, man, trying saying, it on. I'm just saying, man's wearing next man's clothes. What's that supposed to be? You just say, I put on next man clothes. No, <laughs> I'm It's got a t-shirt on yeah. and it's clean. And I've got a t-shirt on. It's not touching my skin. Oh, for fuck's sake, Perz. <laughs> Brother, you trying to tell me that your arms are bigger than mine, you fool. Look how tight it is on me. That's because you're long. You've got long No, look at my biceps, Chris. No, he's a hater. Something is mine. I can't get in there. Because you got a little, you got a little fucking monkey hands. <laughs> look at this. Brother, I can't, I can't put this on. Chris, it can't even do up. You go on like you're a real man. I can't even do this up. Look at this, Perz. Yeah. Even bigger than you. No. I told you. Oh, what did I say? Oh, what did I say? Oh, but if I breathe, the whole thing pop up. <laughs> <laughs> no, brother. Come Chris. on, height. It's all about no, Chris. But in body frame, I'm a person. I'm a person. This is what I'm trying to tell you. He fools you because you look at him in his whole package. He looked like he's got weight. When you see him next to a real fucking redder. <laughs> Look at this now. Imagine this now. Chris, look where my, my elbows where his cufflink is. <laughs> That's got cufflink elbows, you know? <laughs> 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 I got, I got three quarter drink shirt. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> No, you're a pussy, you know? I'm telling you, man. No, you're a pussy, you're a pussy. No, we're a pussy. Man, you're not really a pussy. What size is your neck, man? Tell me. I'm going to ask you this as a condom, but where am I going? Nah, I'm telling you from now, yeah. 
Hold on. Come on. Chris, you know that I've got my shoulders hunched up. Brother. Brother, if I relax, you've got four shirts. <laughs> Let me explain. <laughs> <laughs> Can I talk? Can I talk? All right, go on, talk your things. Go if on, you're a big brother fitting into a little on, Chris. clothes. Look at that. Almost 50. Go on, bitch. Mm -hmm. Go Brother. on. Huh? All right, show them your legs now. <laughs> Why have we got to go down there, Chris? Why have we got to Man go down there? Man put that around here like this. Man cover his legs. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm not going to lie, your legs... He's got big legs, you know? Yeah, my His legs, legs are huge, man. Yeah, man. Me, me leg them trunk still, you know? But look, go on, do it up. Look at this. Fit him like a glove. No, brother, look. Uh, look. Don't forget to put your mic on. Yeah, yeah. My yeah, mic. Fit him like a brush <laughs> <fart> glove. Look at that. He's even got a room. <laughs> He's a pussy. My body's walking around in there looking for, <laughs> looking for the second room. Okay, wait. <laughs> That's the best thing. <laughs> The dickhead, you know. Hey there, hey there. I'm a hater. It's because we're Chris, fluid, you know? Chris, I'm just saying to you, my shoulder came to your elbows. <laughs> yeah, but, what, what you but these men have got pure top half and then they take their trousers off, blood, and their Why legs. Why are you trying to see? Their, legs, take my trousers off. their legs look like pepperoni stick. <laughs> <laughs> Hungry. Your legs are That's eating bad. away. <laughs> my legs are not that bad. They're bad. But brother. I wouldn't put them next to yours. Yeah, I want to you. put them next to yours because you got no, you got them. Man, I said they want to put them leg next to next man. No. What's going on? Oh, for fuck's sake! I'm talking about in comparison. <laughs> See, have you never, have you never seen? No, I'm not a picture. This will wise me up, you know. This will get some of my fucking nerves, you know. No, but if we were in like a bodybuilding competition, mm. do you think that you could get further than me? I would. For, for aesthetics. Yes, compa com yeah. shorter, shorter guys in bodybuilding. No, but you're like, you're no. like. Check it out, shorter guys in bodybuilding, they get, go further because their muscles are more compact. The taller people have to work harder because they've got longer fibers. So I would kill you. No, you wouldn't, Chris. I would, I would kill you. Unless they had like a miniature like um, division. Like. <laughs> <laughs> name me one tall bodybuilder apart from Arnold Schwarzenegger. Chris, please don't do this. Oh, so name me, please. Lou Ferrigno was 6'2". Where are you? Lou Ferrigno, the guy who played Ferrigno. Lou Ferrigno, the guy who played the Hulk. He did he, he um, he what's, the, what's the black guy? Um, Ronnie Coleman. Ronnie, Ro he's not Col tall. How, about, how tall is Coleman, Google, Chris? Google Ronnie Tom Coleman right now. How tall is Coleman? Google him. He's not 5'2". He's I'll in his 5'2". He's not 5'2". <laughs> I'll give you that. There's many, not many bodybuilders over 6'0". There's not many bodybuilders <laughs> over 5'2". I'm but under 5'2". There's loads. Don't be so stupid. How are you telling me about my own, my own field? I'm a PT. I know about bodybuilding, fitness, all of that. And you, you want to come here with your Percy, little long dangly self and tell me about Percy, yeah. there's, Percy, there's no way. All right, then, if you put average height for a bodybuilder, yeah. I, I guarantee... 5'8", 5'10". Are five, you eight, mad, five, Chris? Ten. They're not six foot above. How can you look like a real man Percy, on stage Percy, and you've got Uncle, short limbs like that? <laughs> what does that make no sense? Uncle Percy. What is 1.8 metres? Google 1.8 meters in um, height. Mm, see that? 1.8 meters. What's in this? Height. 1.8. That's that. I'm 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 one six six seven. You're not one six seven, Chris. And that's 1.8. Chris, you're not one six seven. Google it. Google it. Google it. As Percy would say, Let Google me, it. I'm gonna Google how tall one six seven is. 1.8. Google how tall. No, 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 no. No, first of all, go back to Ronnie Coleman. No. Go, go back to Ronnie Coleman. One point six seven meters in feet. Mm -hmm. How tall are you, Chris? I'm five foot seven. <laughs> <laughs> well, the stats you just gave me means you're five foot five. <laughs> no. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's it's wrong. not wrong. Chris, five feet, 5.748 inches. All right, so what's 1.8 then? Because you told, you just, all right, let's go back to this one, because you said Ronnie Coleman was 1.8. All right, let's say I told, if what, let's say I told Lou Ferrigno was. Yeah, how much, Google the average side of bodybuilders no. and the winning bodybuilders. Average side of winning bodybuilders, I beg you. Lou. I beg you. This man won't <laughs> tell me about my score. Ferrigno. Lou this, Fer, look at this, Lou Ferrigno, 1.96. All right, now that's one. 1.96. But he didn't win anything. Chris, are you stupid? What Only have you won? won everything. What did you win? Huh? But I didn't say I was a bodybuilder. <laughs> that's my whole point. But I, that's what, that's what we're asking the about. No, I'm saying the majority of people that's one bodybuilder have all been under six foot. Chris, don't be so ridiculous. Are you telling me? It said between five foot ten and six. 
two inches. Five, five, five foot ten. No, but between yeah. five ten and six two is six foot. That's the average. Yeah, but, but six but foot is average. Ten. No, it's not. <laughs> six foot. But, but, but we're, not, we're not over six foot, though. <laughs> You, I said Chris, between Chris, five Chris. foot and He's six. He's looking at semantics now. You see how he's trying to be clever now. Take back your phone, Percy. You just wasted <laughs> the whole. You make the man use the. You make the man use the last of his credit on his phone. Chris, <laughs> really? We have a bundle for credit. Bundle. You're in Navarra. Shut like, up. You know, the, the old man get Navarra. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Every time you call him, it rings funny. Um, all right. Um, right, so this episode is a very special episode. We've got uh, an amazing guest coming to the stage. Uh-huh. This person, this lady. Is one thirty sixth of a group. <laughs> <laughs> but there was a bag of them. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. There was nothing. But she there. can break it down for us. Yeah, I really want to kind of get into it. So please, everybody, make some noise for Lisa Mafia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, I'm gonna give myself up. Hi. Hey. Hi, Uncle Percy. <laughs> Cute little cop, Katie. <laughs> Don't come in here like that. I'm going to be here myself. <laughs> first things first. Welcome. Thank you for Thank coming. Thank you so much Thank for having me. Um, we're gonna we're gonna bust out a drink first. Yeah. Maybe okay. For our guests. Yes. Mm-hmm. Now, so would you want a drink? Well. You got to have a drink. Well, you got to have a drink. Well, I might as well, because I need to get on you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Go 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 so we've actually got your own drink. I yeah. yeah. Mafia rum. Mafia rum. Where's yeah. the hand rum? See, you got it. That's Big up the salt, man. Yeah. 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 I want to taste it. Watching teeth now. All right, Tina. I think I'm going to do it. Colgate. It's not Colgate and red. It's not red. I'm selling it. Okay. Baby, uh, so you don't want to put it next to Percy's face. Happy. You can't sell this. If you put it next to Percy's face, you lose every customer you have. <laughs> oh, you love me. Listen to me. Leave them alone. Because they see when we start part them, they start bar. Let's carry on. Let's carry on. All right. Let me tell you some of this mafia. Wait, do, I'm do taste you guys it. like spice rum? Yes. Oh, this is spice oh, rum. Right. Spice rum. Right. It. It's spice rum, vanilla, it. That's nice. orange yeah, undertones. It it's pretty cool, guys. It's a premium Chris, brand. Forty you know percent you alcohol. Wow. Mind yourself. You know what? That's a lot of rum. Do you want to mix it? Yeah. We're I... gonna get some of Percy's chaser. Yeah, man. Give it okay, up. yeah. Tell me when to stop. Okay, go on. A bit more. All right. You're um, tight, isn't it? What? Uh, I know that's not. That's it. Don't go to these houses, you know. The man that will give a piece of little chicken for food. The man that. Don't do that to me, Kiss. Don't do that. Don't do that. I just didn't. I just didn't want her to drunk. And the next thing that, next thing that, you find that that she's there. Oh, look at the green. Next thing that you see. No, just say for me. So you give her a little cuss of my head. No, this is for man. Oh, okay, okay. That, it if, makes sense. You don't want to hear that. Um, it after, tastes good, Lisa. It tastes good. If, ah. she, if she finished this, she's like, oh, no. <laughs> she's going to be outside the bar. Watch her outside, lead up, you know. One of her titties, they're hanging out. Oh, my God. Dusty my hair. Listen, you better be careful because that can I know, it's strong, it's strong. It can tastes good do. though, you know. Oh, this is bad. It's nice. You're playing around with like, this. You like, it's like fruity. Okay. Yeah, yeah man. Uh, let's go fruity. Let's do this. Let's do this. Yeah, that's, that's, that's good. That's all right. Yeah, that's People good. ain't tasted this year. Let me just give you a rundown. It's got some sort of je ne sais quoi. <laughs> yeah, this <laughs> It's like a kind of fruity taste, yes. isn't it? What's, yes. what's in it? It's well, I'm not gonna tell you my whole recipe, but it has <laughs> vanilla undertones and, and orange as well. So. Yes, yeah, so I can feel the flavour from the orange. It's freshly it's squeezed. Zinging. <laughs> <That's> fucking amazing. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh Lord is in trouble. Is <laughs> fucking pissed. <laughs> you that that taste good. Good. It's bad, isn't it? It's bad. That tastes good. Yeah, try it. Give me some first yeah. Listen, I don't want to give you no more drink. What, what's this called again, person? <laughs> Um, tropical tea. Tropical tea. And see this, see this chopper right on the sides, man? Oh, yeah. Let's give our next cup. There's, there's enough. This, the, this is the one, with, this one with the alcohol in it. So. Ah! Well, what is our next cup? So okay, so this is this. What we'll do? When she finish this? All right. If she finish this. I don't know if I can finish this. I've got to take my right. time with this. We'll see, we'll see. This is for the cameraman. Jeez. And I'm not gonna lie, to, Reda, you can't drink no more, Chris. Give me some of the person. You need no, the oh, you can have some of this, yeah, but yeah, no, because I'm not getting no more alcohol. <laughs> Next thing, man, leave Christmas the fucking. Christmas call, my man, I drink. Man, <laughs> <sorry. Shut up. laughs> man, man, leave the, man, leave the podcast drunk and go all the number ten shirt. 
And it ain't even a fried chicken. That is a vintage machine. Extra small. You dickhead. With T Rex arms. You know that there's someone selling something in somewhere in the world? There's a brother with tethered in shape. <laughs> wait, wait for someone to type it in. <laughs> wait, 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 no, he's coming. He's coming, he's coming. Mohammed, you'll never sell no shit. <laughs> Daddy, I promised one day I'll send <laughs> shit. Oh, Jay, I'm going to get some drunk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Daddy, wake up, wake up, Daddy, look, somebody ordered them. <laughs> <laughs> no, Lisa, you're from this era. Uh, yeah? You're from this era. Yes. Yeah. I don't know about these, man. You didn't wear this stuff, did you? Pepitos was like Pepito. the, the, the spot. Pepito. Come the on, spot, the spot, the spot. Chris, you didn't have money Oxford to buy Pepitos. Circus. You went on road and you never had money back then. I, was on road I was working and had money, so I used to buy Pepitos. <laughs> <laughs> what, what? He went East Street Market. Thank you. He went East Street Market. <laughs> Don't worry, Chris. I probably was there at some point in my deal. life. No, at least this is a real deal. <laughs> it's a real deal. It's a real deal. Yeah. I even bought this for you just to show you how much. Wow. Oh, Averection, I'm gone. It does look a little bit dusty, though. It's Chris. Proper I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> that red is red out. Like, <laughs> you know the sunny water in the summer, the wind, the summer, the summer, the summer, the summer, the summer, the summer. So it got bleach out. <laughs> <laughs> right, I ain't missing it. It's sick. It is sick. Shots, that, that is probably worth some money now. No, it might be, you know. I'm telling you. That's it's, worth some money that's now. Proper, oh, that's got that's a, an original. Jesus' DNA somewhere. <laughs> 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 Man's got some Old Testament Jesus in there. <laughs> yeah, I have to make it. But um, that's what I said. He got like, have you got clothes that are old like this? I have one Dior set. Like it's and you, that's classic. It's classic. Yeah, like yeah. it's classic, classic. And it, they don't make that print, that same blue and white mm -hmm. print. It's like it looks like Adidas with the, but it's got two stripes with yeah, Dior. Yeah, yeah. It is real for real. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, not proper. fake mix up. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but it's um yeah, I've, I've kept it. I've you kept see? that. But you kept it in good condition. But though. my tits don't fit it no more, so it's just like uh, a, it's like a bra. Oh yeah, because I'm. So I can't should. even put it so on what, again. So hold on a second. Hear yourself. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So listen, real talk, because let's address the elephant in the room. Yes. Like obviously, Come. like Spit when out. when. She spoke about it. I did it? When? Yeah, she spoke about that. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah, before. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm, I didn't see. I didn't see. What do you want, what do you want to see? No, you're not telling me. Get no, it out. No, I'm just... No, get it out, man, you bitch. Yeah, you're you so bitch, isn't it? Oh, no. Oh, poor see it as it is. You're so shy. See it as it is. All right, that's it. I'm going on. No, no, no. That's why I did you keep my jacket no, on, yeah? I'm getting like, my jacket on because of you. No, I'll be honest. Who? Me? Are you? Me? Are you? Don't worry about it. It's not me, you know. It's this. Don't just walk over here. I'm not even looking. It's I'm not looking. I'm not even looking. Listen, it's, <laughs> never, OG. it's, never, the last, it's never me. It's, it's the old, the old one. Never and you, Looking yeah. over your glasses. <laughs> Okay. Man's moving his benches around his back. <laughs> oh you see, I never tried to diverge it to me, and you get kicked out. No, me just a look over here. <laughs> yeah. I saw that Uncle Percy. I saw that. What is that over there? <laughs> so she's flying over here. So, 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 so Lisa. Come uh, on, tell me. Lisa, no, we're gonna move on to something else. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Do Lisa, you get shy? No, I haven't. No, it's not okay, do it. Lisa, so, move on. so when did you um, get them done? Oh, shut out, Chris. He wants to yeah. move on. Yes. We'll move on. <laughs> yeah. We'll move on, Chris. Chris, you're too naughty. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> this one here. We did it. Dusty, moldy clothes. We shouldn't even let him to sit next to us, you know. Trev. How can I be on the podcast with someone with 40 year old clothes? <laughs> And he's kept it as well, you know? <laughs> Can't wait to be in there. What if I flick it out, you know? Best oh one. my God. Um, no, so you were in So Solid. Yes. Um, how, how did that happen? Yeah, how did you come across them? I've Why are you pointing at the tea? You're doing all this. I'm Why are you sorry, keep doing I'm that? Sorry. Stop, Chris. I've heard <laughs> stories. I've be, heard stories like be from... very sophisticated. So um, Harvey, to, uh, you know, I know Harvey. So yeah. he told me a story of how he kind of got recruited. Yeah. Um, Romeo kind of heard a bit 
through Harvey how long mm-hmm. Mia was there. Mm-hmm. But I don't really know your story and what was your journey towards... It's crazy because I grew up in Brixton. I'm the, I'm the only one... Oh, no, actually, there's three of us not from Battersea, me, mm. Face and Scat. The rest of them are all from Battersea sides right, or right. other. Yes. And I, at 13, started hanging out with a girl that ended up being around the so solid boys because of family. Right, okay. Bro, yeah, at 13. Geez. And I, you know, like when you're supposed to stay in your area and you tell your mum, I'm staying in the area, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then I would make, take my bus down to Clapham Junction. Right. Yeah, yeah, to hang out down there. But then we end up going a bit further to someone's house in Roehampton. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But all the boys were there. I knew a couple of the boys from when I was really young. Scat D went to the same play school as me. Scat D don't snitch. Yeah, Scat D don't snitch. Uh, don't is that the same one? Just, 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 no, huh? see, you don't know nothing. You don't know their own. There was about 300 of them. How am I supposed to? When So Solly came out, the man was 50. Wait, that was. That's not nice, Chris. I'm <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Listen, I can't laugh, I'm always there. <laughs> Anywho, yeah. um, I grew up in Brixton, I hang around with a girl that used to go around the boys. And I, as always, I'm such a tomboy. I was mm. a tomboy through and through from yeah. very young. Um, I was the one licking a, licking a tech with a, you know what that is, right? What? Lick a tech, yeah, I used to lick a tech when I was a kid. A bad girl this. Bad girl this. Mm-hmm. And I used to be stealing motorbikes with the boys. Bad Ringers. Girl, right? I used to own Ringers, Ringers. and all of them. No, you should do that now, though. We yeah. shouldn't celebrate right, that no, now. But, but we should <laughs> That's what I never spotted you. No, I said, don't celebrate um, it now. It was fun. a bad past. Chris is still stuck in the past with his outfit. Yeah. He went all. All the yeah, way yeah, back, yeah. Two back and back again. <laughs> yeah, I um, I was just a boy. Wow. Um, you know how when the girls were growing up, there was like that girl that didn't get troubled by any of the boys because she was a boy. That was me. Yeah, yeah. But all my friends, all the girls around me, they ended up troubling the guys, and yeah. then they would get ditched. Yeah. yeah. So I, I was always there in the end with all the boys so because I was like you. more yeah. So I was a more boy boy, you know. Yeah, yeah. I tried to be a girly, but it just didn't happen. Yeah. I was Marga. I was little, a little yeah, piece, yeah. bandy you legs. Know about <laughs> you know about wings standing yeah. in state blood. You don't know about wings. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what do you know about Winston? You see, I was on Angel Town, though. Oh, yeah, Angel, Angel Town, big up Angel Town. Big up that man there as well. Yeah, you don't know about that man. Chris, the I used to run Brixton, brother. Wow. Brixton. <laughs> <laughs> right. You don't know. Don't, just, just look at, look at my resume, yeah? <laughs> check my resume, yeah. yeah. You're chatting shit, yeah? <laughs> but, so, but what's mad is, yeah, how many was in the actual group? So from a little, growing up with them lot, the same amount of people, kind of, most of them followed through to So Solid. So Solid, as, as artists, there were 10 of us, but then we had our own producers, DJs, dancers, everything you can imagine to build oh. an empire. That's why the numbers were there, because there was everyone we needed within our own camp. So there was a good 30-odd-ish more of us. Whoa. And then the girls started coming through, which I was like, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah but it didn't yeah. last long. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> yeah. no, they, Tiger S, Fog Angels, So Solid Twins, the girls. They're yeah. So Solid Twins, the boys as well. But So Solid Twins, the girls. Yeah. There was a few girls, them, yeah. but yeah, I kind of like, it was just me. But um, Megal mentioned something, how he would have like an agency and he would kind of put you, Harvey and Romeo. You were like an the agency. main, not, 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 not an agency, but like, no. if Megal got called, cool, mm-hmm. he'd be like, yeah. You guys, were you guys the main guys of Soul Solid? We're talking no, about I Romeo think what happens Harvey. is that typically we, I was the only girl, so that's probably why I got all the shine. Mm-hmm. Romeo was the sweetest boy yeah, yeah, yeah. and got all the attention yeah. because of that. Yeah, and thought, Harvey was, was like a... hype. Mm, yeah. like you couldn't deny him. Yeah, I wanted JD to be and... Romeo when I was younger. <laughs> Did I'm you? Like, yeah. What's it? Really? When I see man come out, I, that's why I wanted to be hench, you know? But at then, man had... You know but when he you wasn't can, even hench, you know was when, ripped. Yeah, you know when you had a coat and that, no top under? <laughs> I always <laughs> wanted to do that. Yeah. Perfect, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> He saw next man with his top off and got excited. I'm so glad you said that. Nah, he's nah, a, when I saw nah, him with his top off, nah, I, I was, was a kid. Be, I was inspired because I was fat in it. And I, uh, I could see myself being in the leather jacket. Just ripped. In so the this is what you said when you were with your belly Ripped in the leather. <laughs> Chris had this jacket when he was looking at Sun Sun <laughs> with his belly hanging out. In his first trimester, but just dropping his belly. <laughs> You're poor thing. Poor thing. 
Because that also seemed unachievable back then. It was. It was proper Chris used to be proper fat, you know? I Chris was. was a dumpling. Ah, uh, but he was know. cute though, isn't it, Chris? I was. Me. He was cute really... Enough. No, Chris was cute. <laughs> he was so cute. <laughs> <laughs> the man's <Yeah>. eyes. <laughs> Chinky eyes. <laughs> <laughs> But he was cute though. And I couldn't, I, I couldn't oh, deny that. That was one thing I could say. I said, you know what, Chris, you were still good it's looking when you were fat. I had to, I had to do that. <laughs> Although you didn't smile because your teeth weren't fixed then. But... <laughs> <laughs> the teeth, the chaka chaka. Yeah, the, 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 listen. Mine was bad too. No, Lisa, I can't lie. This was, mine this was is bad. I didn't mean, like mine. Chris's <laughs> teeth was bad. My daughter was. My daughter was. My daughter was. Yeah, my daughter was. Chris, did you get Venice? Yeah. Is it? How... As soon as I could. <laughs> Straight away. How was the process? I got them only done maybe four years ago. Oh, okay. So I suffered a very long time. Really? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, what, was wrong with, what did you think was wrong with your teeth? I, well, I've got mixed race teeth. I swear every mixed race kid has got bad <laughs> teeth. What? what? Hey, listen, what? when you mix together and white together, you get me flat with mush up teeth. It's not really? like I'm telling you, they're in, out, in, up, sh bam, sh bam. Is it? Yeah. It what is nice. your background in? I'm Italian and Jamaican. Well, I thought I was until I'd done a DNA test. I'm actually gone in. Oop. See, this is what. So you're Italian and Ghanaian? Yes, sir. Oh, Whoa, awesome. I say that. I'm also Polish and Scottish and all these other things in my white family. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, Tempe mix up. Wow. Yeah. That's, that's where the chaka tea comes from. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. Where does the black and white Scottish man with the Polish tea? Yeah, I'm telling you. The, not the water or tea. Yeah. <laughs> This the is most all right, Baltic, all right, all right. You see, in other stuff, you're the Baltic tea and the snow. <laughs> my friend, my friend Gosto. I am Mr. Buckley's godfather. Oh, stop it, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, you can't uh, do it, uh, you just. Give him an inch, you take the mile. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> They do look good. They do look good. They look good. Yeah, they do. They, they look, look good. Yeah, they do. They're nice they and straight. Good. And they're not, <laughs> yeah, and they're nice not too big as well. Yeah. yeah no, yeah. so, you know, there's loads of people getting the TV teeth. I call them TV teeth, like, come like brick. Like, yeah. like, like TVs. Mm. That's too much. And they're like glowing. Why are you glowing? Why is your mouth glowing? <laughs> yeah, Why? Yeah, Why is your mouth that white? Yeah. What is happening? Your yeah. Yeah, they look like your teeth, but just white. Yes. Yeah. Because they are exactly the same shape as my teeth, but straight. Yeah. yeah. No. So hold on, did you get your, did you get the, the which one did you get then? When they found out they teeth like piranha? <laughs> like shark. <laughs> no, composite, is it called? Com composite. Composite, yeah. Composite bonding. Yeah, but they are still quite thin because yeah. mine was so twisted. They have to do it, So yeah. with your, all right, so then they filed down your teeth a little bit. Yeah. And then put that put on top. Put them on top. As opposed to. And what? some of them at the bottom have actually been taken out and I've got pins. Blood clot. Robot cop in here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mind yourself, you know, you know some you know yeah. somewhere in America is controlling what she's saying, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. So, um, so um, do you have to change them in like next how many years and stuff? I think it's 10 well, years. Well, I think, yeah, probably 10, 15 years. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Is it? Then they could say, well, it depends on if you look after them. I guess if you smoke and all that, like, you know, trash your mouth, yeah. then you, you know, you probably lost a little bit lo le less. Yeah. But if you look after your teeth as if they are you, yours. That's, your and own, that's, a, that's the trick. Then that's the trick. How long did it take? Seven hours, Uncle Percy. Jesus. Seven hours. Our worst. Really? Yes, it's traumatizing. If anybody out there wants to get veneers, don't just don't. Is it, is just it, don't. Is it in Turkey? Just don't. Uh, yeah, I went to Turkey. Okay. I got my shit done for free for a little bit of promo. Yeah. Um, it would have been twenty nine thousand pounds worth of work in the UK. Really? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. In the UK is expensive. Yeah, it's very it? expensive. But then over in Turkey, anyways, where I went, it still would have been probably about nine to ten thousand pounds. But here it would have been twenty nine grand. So. But let's be honest though, ten grand, that's still you know, you it's still ten grand. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you And you gotta go back in ten yeah, years yeah, yeah. and fucking through it all yeah. again, you're taking the piss. Yeah. And, and apparently, <laughs> if you get it done, 
but you can't get, you have to get it done by the same people. So in. I'm insured for 10 years, right. so I can go keep going back 10 years. If anything happens to my teeth, then I can go well, back. Well, you have to get it back done back. by them. But I have a private dentist here oh, that will look after me as well. Wicked. So, Listen, you better make sure that dentist that done your teeth don't dead. Brenda, I'll be checking up on him every day. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know I actually go every March? Every year I go every March just to check in and say hi. Yeah, make sure it's, I'm telling you. Yeah. 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 How are they? Yeah. Is everything all right in there? Yeah. 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 Some businesses, once they leave or they sell on the business, you they, never don't, know. they don't know who you're going to get. That's why you got to have backup. Like, one, you got to have the money to know that you can change it or if anything happens, you can Not pay true. for it. Don't just jump into this thing. Yeah. Because people do that because everybody wants that look, the bum, the the tea, the tits, everything's yeah, yeah, got to change yeah. now. Everyone's doing it. But this is the next thing. Yeah. I always wanted straight the teeth, teeth yeah. because of the industry I, I'm in. Of yeah. course. And they're so critical, aren't they? Of it's course. very critical. Yeah, but at the same that time, smile, it? don't that... go ahead and do these things if you don't have the money to correct it if it goes wrong because it can go very wrong. To be honest, your only other option was to do an Uncle Percy and not show your face. <laughs> yeah, <you know. laughs> That's an interesting Yes. Let's see if it will to go. Not just don't go in front of the camera. Yeah. Just don't go in front of the camera. All right. Yeah. 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 You see Lisa? Yeah. See Lisa in the 21 yeah. second video. This is the car, not this is the car, not So, all right, so back to uh, So Solid uh, now. Yeah. Um, what was we talking about before? I don't then? know, because you was going to ask the question. Yeah, so I was asking about... <laughs> <laughs> Get off the road. Uh, you're so, drunk at this one here, you know? All right, so, so, so you said you were... Um, you was part of, like, 30 plus, mm. yeah? Um, and what I asked you before about sort of, like... Um, uh, there was, like, a division, right? So mm -hmm. you heard about... The rest, you didn't really hear much about the rest of them. The main guys you heard about was yourself, yeah. Harvey, Romeo, and Mega. Mm -hmm. Asha D as well. Asha D, yeah. Asha D, yeah. So I how, think, I think, what was you going to say? Sorry, finish. No, so I'm saying, so how did that, that run? Was it like they were just asking for you guys to perform yeah. and not the rest, or did you look? I'm going to snitch on Mega, you know. <laughs> Mega wanted to play boss and was very lazy and didn't want to come to any other school. So we went out there. Grafting, like oh. we are back to the grafting. Oh, we were doing it? all the school tales, 4 a.m. waking up, getting to 10 schools a day, mm -hmm. doing all the promo. So is when it? you're building yourself up, who was there? Me, Romeo, Harvey, Keish, um, Scatty, now and then, Face, now and then. Yeah. But we were the committed ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So when you come to the end of it now, <laughs> who did they want? The ones that were committed. Yeah. Not to say Mega and that didn't put their work in, yeah. but they did the big glass glossy shows. The grafting shit yeah. wasn't yeah, yeah. us not going out and going radio tours and all that. Lot. They were there now and then, but I think that's partly why we got signed first. Mm -hmm. And once we got signed, the budgets were spent. Right. We got signed, I got signed by the same label that signed So Solid, okay. Independiente, part of Sony. Okay. So once I got signed, they gave the money to me, Asha and um, JD, Jade Dreddy. Remember Dreddy that made all over? Du -du 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 Dreddy. You remember Dreddy? Dreddy is the producer <laughs> of all of our, of my, well, my biggest oh. single. And he made a couple of the So Solid tracks as well. Right. Dread guy. But he got signed as a solo artist and a producer. He's now working with Busta Rhymes and Sick. people oh, like that. Okay. He's big, he's big, he's big. He's living in Philly. Nice. But look what yes, happened now. <laughs> you see where Destiny take this lovely lady? <laughs> All the way around the world to me. Ah. <laughs> you want to know why? Because I'm starting up my whole little group. <laughs> and I was going to call it Percy and Lisa. Oh. <laughs> you want to buy? Boom, 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 boom. Me and you on the late night in the studio make some lover dub music. Oh, lover dub. On the candle. Lover dub music. Lover Shut dumb. up. Oh. You know what I mean? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Uh, that's wicked, man. So, <laughs> Why? so, so obviously you lot bust out on the scene with yeah. uh, Twenty One Seconds. Yeah, yeah. Before I... that was Oh No, though. Oh, it was just a little thing. Oh, really? Was that before Twenty One Seconds? Yeah. 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 So, I tell you what happened with that. There's a story. Oh, like you know, you just. I was a so funny fan. So I tell you what happened with that. All right, go. On. That single was meant to be our very first single, but little did we know, we was with a um, a label called Relentless Records. Right. They didn't know that putting four tracks on a single meant it was an album. Uh, so it got put into the album charts. Of course, no one, 
do anything in the album yeah, chart because right, it's yeah. part of the same song. Yeah. So we just oh. flopped with that. Not flopped because we sold hundreds of thousands on white label out of the back of a van. We done our work with that. Yeah. And it also established us as musicians. That's right, yeah. But it was just me, Mega and Romeo. Well, it was actually me and Romeo mm. and Mega was just in there because he told me to sing. It's just a little thing. Yeah. Can I just say something? Sorry. Mm. Mega, was he the one in control of so solid, because that's the impression that I got. So, yeah, that's what I got. So it's not that he wasn't. He was a good mouthpiece. Mega right. Man is a good mouthpiece. The talker, the business. He's right. a good talker. Mm. That guy can chat <laughs> for years. <laughs> if he will listen, he'll be there around 10 years. He'll be like, right. yes, Mega. Uh, <laughs> All right, Meg. <laughs> <laughs> OK, Meg. And he will still be there like, and basically, yeah. it, and we them. was more interested in being artists. OK. So Mega took that role. All right, right. Okay. But before before Mega established that role, mm. we were all individually doing okay. something. And not to say he wasn't the most creative, because yeah. he was so creative. He had his brain is just weird. Yeah, he yeah, creates yeah. things out of dust. Yeah. That guy has got a really creative mind. But we also allowed him as a mouthpiece yeah. to speak for all of us because there were so many of us. Not all of us can go in Sony yeah, at the same time and be yeah. like, okay, what's my percentage? They'll yeah. be like, police! Yeah, exactly. Security! Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Imagine they, 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 they argue for free. Get these guys out of here quick now! And they only now. argue for 2% each. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Exactly that. No, I'm not gonna lie. If I was in that group, I'd have turned sniper. I'm killing up everybody. I'm telling you. No, my percentage. I've got two percent, and I'm and I'm singing just a little bit. Who brought the group together? Was it Mega that created? So what happened before Say Solid? There was SOS. Oh. I didn't know that. Did you know you, that? You didn't yeah. know that. SOS, SOS, killer. <laughs> winner, winner, winner. <laughs> but someone else was already called SOS. So we had to change our name. Oh, yeah. And they've not was all doing pirate radio anyways. What did SOS mean? I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't... Do you know, so that was before solid. me. <laughs> so solid. We can make our own team. Let's make our own yeah, team yeah, yeah. tonight. <laughs> Uh, yeah. But whatever that was, it was, it was happening before yeah. when Pirate Radio was happening, when all that other stuff was happening. That was way before me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you weren't on the Pirate Radio stuff, was it? No. Yeah, because that's no. when I used to hear Romeo and then Mandel. So I was brought in because, this is what I'm saying. So Romeo and Dan, let me get this right, because they're not going to cuss out my blood clot. Mm -hmm. Oh, Dan. Well, well, I, don't you. <laughs> I don't remember who exactly was in Napa, but them lot got stuck in Napa. Right. And Glenn from Relentless Records uh -huh. saw them. Oh. And that's how So Solid was discovered, in wow. a sense. Really? The next year, Romeo's like, look, me and man has to come out to um, Iron Upper, Upper, Iron Upper, it's happening. All of them have flown out and done a season in Iron Upper. Right. We was established really from Pirate Radio at home, mm. but over there we were spotted by a record label. Okay. Oh, and then they signed you from over there. Hey. Hey. You see, I get the real story live hey. and done it here. Mm -hmm. so, I do, I might have parts of things wrong because as I said, I wasn't very much there at the mm -hmm. very beginning. Mm -hmm. As much as I was around them, I weren't the musician. Yeah. I, I came in as a musician when G and Mega wanted to put me on sentiment things oh no okay yeah and that's Just how i became thing. yeah that's how i became part of so solid yeah. and we i don't know if i ever thought that 21 uh, sorry not 21 seconds oh no would be anything right. when everyone was like put your vocals on the track i'm like Psh, what does that fucking mean yeah like okay fine and then that tune was, became it was just me and romeo on oh, that track that wasn't even sorry oh what you doing this boy just now. Just now. Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, just now. Are oh, you sure? Yeah, just now. Oh, <laughs> just now. Just now. Yeah. Just see it. <laughs> <laughs> just look oh, at the tree. Okay. Look at the tree. Just look away. Just look away. Just now. Just now. Just now. Okay. I'll be like, I can feel it. That's why I'll pull it back in. Okay, okay, great. Okay. <laughs> 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 so, so, yeah, saying? I don't, I've lost my train of thought because of this fool. Oh, no. 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 You didn't think it was going to do it nothing? Yeah, I didn't think it was going to be anything. They asked me to go on the track. I was a person, I was a girl that loved music. It was a hobby. Right. I loved it. I loved singing along. I loved recording myself as a kid. So you it was wasn't just a, a passion. You, you didn't do rapping or anything? No, just singing. it was just a passion that yeah. 
Like when we was little, me and my sister, it was just me and my sister and my mum. And we used to perform for my mum. My, mm. Like we used to be like, watch us do this. It was like some old reggae song or something my yeah, mum loved. Yeah, yeah. And then we went to school, we went to uh, so your mom's dance school. From, your mum's from Jamaica? No, no, she's Italian. Oh, your mum's Italian? In British, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. British, darling. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> uh, we used to go dance school, like uh, tap, modern, ballroom. That's me and my sister. So I come from a very performer type of lifestyle growing mm. up. Um, so going into So Solid, it was like going and doing music in general was like, oh, it's just, yeah, it's just whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Done what I was told. Sing this, sing this least. Yeah, sure, I sing that. Mm. Done. Didn't think about it. How is one year later we're getting signed? We're like, what's signed? How what old were you then, though? Uh, 19, when I first started out. That's mad, mm -hmm. Yeah. You know what's mad, yeah? I remember oh, I used to go out, I remember going out raving, and I used to see you lot like, in the clubs. Because I'll I tell you why I used to see you. Not me, though. Not you. <laughs> yeah. I remember, I remember. That's when things were going down. I yeah. was not there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Where's my camera? I, yeah. was, I weren't there. Yeah. I weren't there. I weren't there. Yeah. 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 I was not there. Yeah. Yeah. Weren't me. Yeah. Yeah. That wasn't yeah. me. You don't even know what I'm going to say <laughs> It's coming like, hey, you just yeah. never know what might come out of the woodwork. It wasn't me. I went there. I swear, officer. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. <laughs> no, but I remember I used to see them out and I used to look. Where the, the, what, where? I'll tell you what club it was. All right, so I don't remember. The, no, 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 no. I think it was Café de Paris. You me? No, I'm joking. No, there was, <laughs> no, there no, was a club yeah. that used to be up the road Cavity from Café de Paris. Paris. No, up the road from... Ten? Ten rooms? Might have been ten. No, no, no. Ten rooms around the corner. Along the same road as Café de Paris, I remember seeing... And it was used to go... It, it was further down the road. I think it's, a, I think think. it's a strip club now. Oh, mm -hmm. oh, oh. Well, you know what that... Of course you would know it's a strip club. club. I think it's a strip club. Dirty Rachel. Dirty Rachel. Purple lace or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Remember she's number 7243. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I remember I used to see I used to see them out and I used to always see them in VIP and whatever, but they were huge then, top of the pop, mm. the whole like the whole one. And you know what? It was so inspired, even me, because I'm a bit older than you lot, but it was so good for me even to see. Like a young black so, collective yeah, out in the yeah, club, yeah, and yeah, I was just like, yeah. that was phenomenal. It did a lot for us, you know. You yeah. know why that video was? The video was what bad video? as well. The twenty one second video. Uh, it was an epic video. It was so epic. bad. What was one of your time? At the time as well, the amount, the, the, the graphics that you know had on Do you know how much them videos cost? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to boast up myself right mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. My video was the most expensive out of the entire So Solid catalogue. Really? It was £290,000. Which one was that one? How? When I think about it now, I'm like, I well, obviously That's we bad. recoup for that shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah? yeah. That's oh, how much. <laughs> We could have got you to fucking record it. Babe, for a fiver. <laughs> for for fucking £2.50. You would have done it for weeks. <laughs> <laughs> the way I say it, I'm off the Wingstop tenders. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, but that's how much things cost because it was on real movie film. Yeah, RE like, cameras and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real film, that like, snippet by snippet by page by, you know what I mean? Which is one of your highlights of your career? Most memorable. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay, one of them, there's lots. Because mm -hmm. I, I only look back now and realize and appreciate what I've done. That happens. At the time, you were just doing. Just doing it. Yeah. yeah, and I don't know if I liked it. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. know if I really yeah. enjoyed it because it was really demanding and it took me away from my child and yeah, took me imagine. away from being normal. I couldn't go outside and yeah. do things like Your that. Your child so, was the one in the um, 21. Yes, yeah, the little girl. Ah, we we laughing like that. Chelsea! Oh, Chris! <laughs> big up Chelsea. That made my big life. Up Can I just say, yeah? Big up Chelsea. I, I have to big up Chris. <laughs> For knowing that. Yeah. I have to be done, Chris. Because I, I, I've got a character called and, Branches. And Mega's son yeah. is the boy next yeah. to her. Yeah, and I've got a character called Branches, and I keep boasting about how I made that line, and I want my royalties. <laughs> <laughs> so Chelsea, you know, what you want for that? Chelsea, what have you want for that? I made that rhyme, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I know. It's That's G, G Man actually told her what to say. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, oh, so really clear. Was a, he was another creator. That was a classic bit, you know? Yeah. That, that right at the beginning. You yeah. Know? yeah. I remember that. Sorry, it what? was actually G Man that, that created 21 seconds to each person would 
make a track. Yeah, so... Did you know that as well? Is it, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Is it actually 21 seconds? Sorry, don't seconds? lose train of thought of what no, you're no, saying. No, 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 no. So are you saying it's actually 21 seconds? It's 21. We've all got 21 seconds each. And right. that because we worked out for the amount of artists that we needed to get out. Because Ono was just two of yeah. us, me and Romeo. Yeah. We needed to get the rest of them out yeah. at the same time. How do we do that without breaking the bank and doing yeah. bare tracks to an establish each individual artist? So G came up with the concept, 21 seconds each, and then it could makes a three minute oh. track. Ross, 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 one more man, one more man's a mathematician. No, no, hundred percent. He was the one that was selling the weed. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are gonna be our part of part of pawn, our time. And this year, we're not gonna get one yet. <laughs> What's your question? Yeah. Be, I forgot. Uh, but, I I that I that that but, but that's me though. But, how, but do you know what? Do you know that's genius though? Like, it is. When you think about it, bro, and you know it's so organic yeah. when things like that come You know come why around. it's organic as well? What, what I liked about Lisa is that there was a bunch of male testosterone. And you, you, sausage she, yeah, 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 yeah. And then she, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then she just came in. <laughs> I got 21 seconds to pass about. I don't care. <laughs> See what I got? I said, yes! Yeah! Let's see what I'm saying, bro. Yeah, Chris was in front of the mirror, you know? Good face. Go, Lisa! Go, Lisa! Go, Lisa! Go, Lisa! Go, Lisa! You don't like me anyway. <laughs> Trying to be you though as well. That was sick. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but man. you know, we're really inspirational though, you know. Really? Yeah, real talk. You so, know this. Listen. You no, know it's this. nice. It's nice to hear it so many years after. Uh, trust me. It's so nice, and people of uh, of age. Yeah, you know? it's nice. You were facing a generation. You, yeah. you sound like she set the pace. She did. Yeah. She they set the pace. Listen, right you, you lot, honestly, you lot, you lot, because it was the first time I had seen a black group uh, or black individuals on TV that spoke and looked like me dressed yes, like And yes. I was just like, do you know what? And we actually were saying what the hell we wanted. And that's yes. what it was. And I was just like, Ooh. I love that. And the fact that you look what, it seemed as if like Mega was like the, the main guy. So it's yeah. like, it felt like it was with all a little in-house. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it felt that like it was all in-house, like yeah. it was managed, but it felt like a, like a Puff Daddy type thing. Yeah. Yeah. That's, yeah. What it, yeah. that's the vibe it was. Yes. What nice to see Mega Ma- that's what Mega gave, you know. He yeah. gave that, Puff, he, did, he, he gave that inspiration of like, we can you do can it do too. It. Mm. We can do 100%. it too. So what? That's how like, I felt. That was, that was what he yeah. gave. Yeah, I mean, definitely. I wasn't inside the VIP at the time. I was outside watching this. I just watching all the jelly, though. Right. <laughs> 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 How did I get in there? What do I have to do? I have to look around four bounces. Just try and catch one nipple, you know? Is it? Right. Is that mega sucking two nipples? Right? <laughs> <laughs> what did you think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Oh, I've got a question for all of you, though. Who was you lot's favourite MC out of the Say Solid crew? Ross. Ross. All right, so... That's an easy question for me. Yeah, I, know really? what I know what he's going to say. Of course. Oh, well, God. I heard... Mo- the, mo- the most people I heard from Soul Solid was um, Asha D, mm-hmm. Harvey, and who's the other one? Romeo. What about Neutrino? That's what I wanted to ask you. Was Neutrino yes. a part of Soul Solid? So yeah. Oxide and Neutrino were an addition That's to Soul Solid Neutrino. and started up Neutrino. Yeah. <laughs> and then Oxide. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but they they were a great addition and they would have at the very beginning. But they got a deal. Why not take it? Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, they, they, came, yeah, they took yeah, the deal, yeah. man. They, Bound for the Reload sold. Milli- like hundreds of thousands, oh, my mother, hundreds my mother, of thousands mother, really before it got signed. Because we used to, listen, me and G bought a broke down backfiring fan <laughs> to sell records out of the back no. of before no, it was like like man. We like were things. on the street selling it out yeah. of the back of the van. I like you that. Know I like that. You know, my favorite song. On advice of my mum as well, you know. Sick. My mum was like, get your own, sell it yourself. Yeah. Get down the market. No, and we said, that, you'll get out of there, Lisa. You go out and sell it. You go out to the market. Yeah, you buy yeah. the yeah. it is. Let's go. You have to do it. You have to I do it. it. You have to do 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 it. 
Your father is, is your grandfather is from the mafia. <laughs> you live your destiny, Lisa. <laughs> All right, so um, I could tell you my favorite tune was, but I get. My favorite so what you ever told me your best MC? All right, all right. Yeah. my best you MC. To, you lot are trying to get out. You haven't heard it in a long time. All right, okay. We can answer you first. All right, go on then. <laughs> She's sitting right beside me. Oh, oh he's so cute. Oh, he's a pitney, he's a pitney. Shut up, what is he pitney? <laughs> what is that? He love a girl. She wants to do a love man. No, you know what it is? <laughs> <laughs> she's an MC. MC. She's not an MC. Shut she's up your mouth if I want to tell you. Excuse me, Chris, I can MC you know. Exactly. Give it a fucking break. All right, we're yeah. going to MC later. Me okay. and you're going to go back to back. Oh, yeah. oh we'll Lord Jesus. We're going to go back to back. Chris, don't embarrass yourself. I don't want to back it up with you, though, Chris. Uh, listen. Oh, you're done, Chris. You're done, Chris. You're done, Chris. You're done, Chris. Allow me, man. You're done, Chris. Allow me, Chris, man. Chris, Chris, you know for how many months Chris been chatting about he used to be MC? He used to be MC. Go on, go on. Do one thing now, then. Wait, what was your character? Branches. Branches? Oh, my, yeah. Don't know what they say, obviously. Then put the tea out. Yeah, yeah. Go to you, I did a skit with um, Harvey and Ashley. Did D. you? Yeah, with MC and all three of us. You get me? I, I saw that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, we have right? to put a clip yeah, of that yeah, in. That. I have to see that. Yeah, man. <laughs> um, so mine was Asha D anyway. Asha D. Yeah. Yeah. Like, he had a distinctive voice as well. Yes. You know yeah. what I mean? So that's, yes. what, that's yes. what I liked about it. Asha D was good. Um, I think Romeo. Yeah. It's a flawless It's a flawless <laughs> It was lazy but distinctive yeah, as well. Yeah, it was, it was distinctive. It was the bass line. He's got real bass line. Yeah, man. He had the, Come on, yeah. tell me, tell me, tell me. I'm going to tour this one out of shell. Why did it all slow down? Why you know what? No, but it slowed down This though. is Chris's childhood playing out in front of us. Yeah. This Chris, you wanted to be proper so solid, didn't it? Yeah, man. Oh, <laughs> What's, no, no, what would be yeah. your so solid name then? My yeah. name, so solid name. They call Talawa. They call me Talawa. This girl what? back from the Talawa. 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 I would do. No. Talawa. No, little Talawa. Dog, little yeah, me, you know, like Jamaicans say, we're little but we're Talawa. Talawa. Yeah, uh, I'll call myself Oh, okay. Talawa. Okay, yeah, that makes we're sense. little but we're Talawa, meaning rugged. Talawa. <laughs> you get me? Talawa, everyone. He's just got flats. I know, I don't mind. He's just got flats. I can give you. I'll give you a name. Sorry. He's such a name. You should say something name. He's such a name. He's muscle teeth. Oh, shit. That's who he is. Protein shake and straight teeth. But no, my favorite track by Soul Solid was, it has to be the one with Dynamite, man. Um, Why that's the remix, they did the remix, yeah. 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 Is yeah. it your dream? I don't want to fight tonight. I don't want to fight tonight. I don't want to fight tonight. I don't want to fight Trust me. <laughs> Can I just yeah. say? See when that track drops in the race? Man, it goes back even now. Does. Even it now. It still does. Apart from, apart from, <laughs> and P Percy, you know, Percy hit me once yet. <laughs> He don't know what the fuck we're talking about. Wait, no, no, no. You know, just was... sit down here and listen to them. I just sit down here and listen to them. I just sit down listen to them, they could pop you. No, but big track for Soul Solid as well. Go on. Dilemma. Dilemma. What's that, what's that one? Boo, boo, boo. Boo, boo. It was just production, it was the biggest beat. It was in a club, we literally were Germany with beat. You don't know about the dilemma. I must know it. You don't know. You know it, right? You know it. You know it. The team knows it. The team knows it. I must know it. I must know it. You must know it. Will you hear it? You know what it is? It was it's because of Chris. Chris doesn't do it now. It's <laughs> 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 Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This is 
one of the best ones in like, you know. Uh, I love Lisa, man. You get what I mean? I'm a soul solid fan, so it's good to have my, you know, you know when you grow up watching people mm. yeah. and you're actually sitting in front of them, like, I'm, I'm in, I'm in awe. You. Do you know what I mean? So it's a big thing to me. No, so this is like, like you know, you're at the end. Yeah, that's yeah. why I bought this the is, shirt and everything. <laughs> this is your, like, this is your, his perfect guess. Ah. No, I'll be honest, because, all right, because you think about it, yeah, Chris, like, when he does his characters, he did Branches. Yes. Branches is set back then. It is, yeah. yeah. About yeah, you guys yeah, yeah. Well. Uh, do you understand? Yeah. So it's like that's this... how I first discovered you. That's right. Yeah, see what Madness, I mean? When I did it? that character, you yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, so it's yeah. like it was all to do with that era. Yeah. So to see one of my people that I looked up to back in that era, it's a big God bless No, I'm the ready for that. I'm ready for that. God bless you. Yo, yeah. show up your homage. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm not happy with that. I'm going to bring in a guest, like from my era. Yeah. And then some old yellow. Shut up, yellow. Let's be serious. I'm thinking about. I'm thinking yellow about. Yellow man, are you in? I'm thinking about Percy Bowser Ruffin. Yeah. Brother, they're not with us anymore. 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 No, sorry, please. Let's drink a drink. Let's drink. All right, come on. All of Pass is musical heroes. You're brave. All right, so what ended so solid? I don't think so solid ever end. A lot of people ask this question. All right, but what me was and the Romeo, sort of like I think, of, of the entire crew. Yeah, because there, the there was a made a fight the or something in the club. The media rack us up bit by bit. They they sort of. Right. Just chipped away at us, you know. There, uh, the first, I think the first thing was Astoria, Romeo's birthday bash. Yeah, yeah. Um, Astoria that went left, and that was no fault of our own. Oh, what, what, it was like madness? Yeah, so like, uh, Sorry, I mean, I was maybe fifty percent. Was you there? Yeah. You look harassed. Did you get on the stage? Yes. Yeah, because some people. Yeah, they come about fifty percent off. Can I have a little bit more of the mafia room? Yes, yeah. you can, That's sir. Cool. About 50% of the crowd wanted to get on the stage and it all started off because somebody said something to someone on the stage and the cake got dashed and I, mean, I just remember a birthday cake being dashed in the crowd and yeah. the crowd then started coming on the stage but it all got very out of control. I heard about that and it was in the newspapers, wasn't it? It was indeed and that was maybe the start alongside other stupid things the boys were doing. Right. We were kids with millions. Yeah. We got signed, some of us as young as 18. Bruh. The eldest was 25. I don't know how we had uh, yes. We, I mean our first deal was yeah. millions. What? So for us, we were left without guidance, with no team really around us that cared enough to 100%. care for us. Nobody that came from the same as us. No black people, no, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. No hood people, no people that's come up on a struggle. So we were left with to our own devices with money. Yeah, that's mine. The fuck? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't fuck. That's a bad message. Like, we can do what we want. Yeah, yeah. Don't tell me nothing. I got money. Yeah, yeah. Give me so, <laughs> <laughs> It was literally that. So we and we weren't helped in that sense. We had to work shit out along the way ourselves. Yeah. So we're making dumb mistakes. And I say we, the boys, were making dumb mistakes. Luckily for me, I was partnered with G Man. I was he, that me and him were boyfriend and girlfriend. Oh, and right, we okay. and I had a child at 17. So you kind of mature. You was more mature. Honey, I was I'm, mature. I was looking for a mortgage. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And back then, it must have I'm, been about three grand for the house. I go pay a cash. No, but I done dumb shit with my money. Uh, I had free cars on my drive and shit, dumb yeah, shit. Yeah, 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 but at the same time, there was no guidance. But know. luckily, G was a yardie. He mm. came from a yard. Yeah. He came here at nine, so he had a yardie mentality. Okay. He was like, buy a house. We bought a house to give our first check. <laughs> Got that house. Ooh, that okay. allowed us to me to keep. In, uh, investing in property. Really? Yeah, so yeah. luckily, that was my luck. But not everyone had that same, you awesome. know? I was lucky to have G to And them just had money and yeah, You get on chat saying yeah. craziness. Yeah. But it was also just, don't fucking tell me I've got money. Like, yeah. I would pay my way out of shit. If I get in trouble, psh, I get the best lawyer. What? Yeah. It was that. And it was that, car that carried on quite a long time. And that affected us because everything that was happening around the garage scene, which was very young, very diverse, very London, but very diverse as well. There were troublemakers within that industry. Yeah. So there was a lot going on in the club, no fault of our own. 
Yeah. Outside Luton, there was a stabbing. Out this yeah, one, yeah. there was that. You know what I mean? Like, mm. There was lots of different stories going into the fucking press because we were big yeah. that were no fault of our own, but then it were they, because they of our music. Yeah, yeah. So we people, were being responsible. Sorry, Chris. And a lot of people wanted to jump on you guys because they, they were haters as well. Yeah, oh, and that as well. Yeah, you lot must have as well. you lot had so much beef from... It's well, Harvey was telling me that the beef that he used to account like in Iron Apple, man would jump him. Yeah. And, you know what I'm saying? He got stabbed, didn't it? Yeah, he did, yeah. 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 But yeah. Also, we were still not educated enough to get the fuck out of our areas. We were still living in, in the, the hood yeah, yeah. with all that money. Shit, not bro. thinking, get your family out and get the fuck out of here. Yeah, I yeah. did. Yeah. I went to Kent. Yeah. See <laughs> 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 you, bitches. So bye, Ash, darlings. <laughs> Ciao. And then I'm up to my boat, man. I'm 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 to 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 shit. Get I'm out of to 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 <laughs> here. <laughs> Do you know what? Yeah. And do you know what? Do you know what? Are you still in property? Or yeah, still, yeah, let yeah. Let me tell you something. I swear to you, the best thing I ever did with my money was put it in property. property when I was young. I, I'm the not gonna lie, though. That wasn't the best thing. The best thing was buying all them cars and all that highlight. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I had so much fun. Yeah, but, <laughs> but yeah. When you look All back right. now, because I listen, yeah. I squandered, squandered money as well, squandered. but not like that. I, I used to. At one point, I had two cars. At one point, chop it, didn't it? I know. It's and Why? one of them was just sitting there, and they're all black, nothing. but no one's driving them. Like, and they're just sitting there, three just black cars. Just what the say. fuck, I need three black yeah. cars. Don't make no sense. But that, like you said, guidance. Yeah, that's the thing. Guidance. And when you give young people money, no guidance, brother, that's a recipe for disaster. Anybody. Mm. Anybody, like, even like, with, I never, I, did, I was all right. When I was, I made money, a little bit of money in my 20s, mm. invested in properties. Mm. And so that's what's allowed me to kind of. What taught you to do that, though? Just me. Just you. I made some money. Bouncy, you know. Yeah, but I didn't know. But I didn't know. No, I mean, honest, no, I didn't know what to do. Bouncy. Bouncy, isn't it? Miss, Miss Ken. Miss Ken. I went out and I was out of there. I was like, my bitch, my bitch. I'm walking out there like that. Right. But I'm the bouncy one. My bitch, my bitch. Oh, my God. No, but that's the man. Honestly, I love hearing stories like that because yeah. I think nothing's worse than just having stories to tell and having nothing to show for it. I think that... Oh, my God, I should have way more to show for you it. You should have Jeez. more, but you've got something. Like, but so some much. of the members, let's be honest, they probably don't have anything like what you've got. Not as much, yeah. but one thing they do hold, and I say this, is that no matter what you have accumulated through money, if you've got memories, good, mm. happy, that happiness, oh, yeah. Yeah. Listen, that's that. worth way more than any yeah. type of property asset or anything. Of okay, it will let you live good. Yeah. But if you haven't got happy memories and yeah. you didn't make your money in good stead, mm. that's why I don't deal with nobody that comes with crosses money. I call it crosses money because when they come with that money that has bad comes, energy, yeah, right, yeah. I'm out. No, I'm not interested yeah, because yeah. for me, it's not worth making upset money where I have to chase my money and ask you for my money a billion times. You, I heard you saying this for yeah. on another episode yeah. that you were chasing promoters for your money. That's right. Mm. That shit don't work. I know. <laughs> yeah, 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 I know. That yeah. does not work yeah. for me. Yeah. For me, I'd rather make happy money. Clean money. Mm -hmm. Clean yeah, money. Yeah, yeah. With Money is the root of all evil. Mm -hmm. If you have to make bad money, it's not it's worth not gonna, it. It's not going to be worth it. Do what makes you happy. Yeah. That's, that's key in happiness of life. Ah, true. <laughs> so, so in terms of your uh, music now, do you do any more music now? Or is it just... Do you know what? I've been writing for people. I'm not a great writer anymore mm -hmm. because I just sort of had that. So I think it's because too many right, years of doing it, right? Just, yeah. yeah, just I kind of quit on it. Luckily for me, I've been so blessed to have incredible music behind me and yeah. I work four, five, six gigs a week regardless really? every year and I have done for 21 years. Oh no, years. hold on, wait. Yeah, but you still have a Last weekend, yeah, every weekend. Every weekend, yeah. Friday to Sunday, every weekend it's tiring, it's jarring sometimes. I just went to one club the other day, yeah? Weeks, Talking yeah. about gigs. I love that. I went to a club, <laughs> I went to a club, yeah. <laughs> No respect for me as an artist, you know. Mm. These are the type of gigs that will mash up your career. <laughs> See? Yeah. You get to the club and nobody did tell you that it's bare one eaters. Like bare one eaters in there with one tea. <laughs> one eater. <laughs> one eater in that club. Nobody did tell 
tell me <laughs> that there's better than rejects in the club and now oh, to his foot girl. Bang! With the lean up boots. Yeah. <laughs> With the ski slope up boots. <laughs> like, <laughs> Why? Why am I here? Yeah, that's right. What is happening? <laughs> Have some respect and put some respect on my name. Don't put me for this bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, that still happens. But I do give and count my blessings that I am still here after 20 years That's of mad. performing. 21 years. It's 20, 2000. True, you, know. 2000. You, do any, you do any festivals or anything yes. like that? Yes. I've done 30, 30, 30 odd festivals this year. I've I done, I done 79 gigs this year thus really? far. And I've still got three next week and two New Year's and Boxing Day. That's oh, good. Yeah, no. That's good. That's, me that's and dope. Romeo. It's me and Romeo. That's dope. Me and Romeo clean up. Romeo, yeah. We man. clean up. And we, I decided um, in 2015, 16, to start my own agency. Mm. I blagged it. All I did is I kept going to the gigs, collecting the number, collecting the number, collecting the number. And then I went back to them and I was like, hello, I'm uh, Selena. I'm Lisa Mathis, PA. I told you that's what they fucking do. <laughs> you can say that today. I said that on you another said that. episode. Yeah, yeah. Said that. I'm Selena, Lisa Matthews, PA. Yeah, I just Essex as well, you know. And, and uh, would you like? Yeah. Would you like to book Lisa Matthews for your stage performances thing that you do down at your club? What? Wow. <laughs> what can you do? And when they ring, you'll be like, yes, it's me, it's Selena. <laughs> Lisa Matthew costs five grand. Would you like to book her? If you don't want to book her, what we could do is do a deal if you ain't got that sort of money. So let me know what your budgets are and then you can book Lisa Matthew. It's fine. Sick. It's fine. Sick. I'm telling Sick. you, that's how, no, 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 that's how it started out. That's how it started out. The road's still in there. The road's still in yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, the road's yeah. The hustler come out in me yeah, because the dip came and I saw so my gigs go from 12 a week yeah. to one. Yeah. yeah. I said, not our dear ass. No. <laughs> yeah. 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 So I, yeah she I had to, to sort it out. She said, I've got to get my teeth done. Yeah. Teeth, 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 after maybe two years of doing it, I had accumulated 4,000 contacts mm. because I had mm. so many gigs. And I decided Gee. to get someone on board yeah, you to maintain at that it. Point. Yeah. yeah, but I still manage it. I still now manage it. I booked for H. I gave H his very first festival on my own festival. Wow. Really? And I'm so proud of that H. one because he's amazing, isn't he? Oh, he's H. gone clear. Yeah, yeah, H, yeah. H, yeah. He's gone clear. So I'm so proud of that. And Chipmunk, where one of his very first gigs I got, one of his really? when he first started out. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. In, it was called Demand in Coventry. Yeah. So yeah. that's amazing. Love you, Chip. Thank Big you for up. giving hey. me that chance. All right, so now you mentioned <laughs> Chip and that. We're yeah. going gonna to go back in time now. I remember it was a massive. Do you not remember the uh, Soul Sully Crew versus Heartless Beef? Ew. Do you remember that? <clears throat> I didn't have part of it. I do, that. I do, I do. Vaguely, vaguely. No, sit out like this. Wait, <laughs> <laughs> No, no, can no, I just no, ask you no, all right, no, wait, wait, wait. All right then, can I, can I just say something, yeah? Bush King and Mighty Can I just say, did them man there kick off at um, fucking Coliseum? Coliseum or, or um, no, Alexandra Palace? Yeah. Um, Ali Pali. Yeah, Ali Pali, isn't it? Ali Pali went left. Okay. No, but it didn't actually go left. I don't know. I want you to give the flowers to Heartless because Heartless are from North. Yeah. We were in North. Yeah. Of course they're going to win. Yeah, of course. But they are fucking course. sick. At the they same were, time, were, they were, they were Heartless helpful. are bad at what they do. Yeah. They are sound men. Um, there's a the difference between MC and being clashy. Amen. Type. And you know what Amen. I mean? You guys had the records, but Heartless had the We have, but yeah. See, they couldn't contend and compete with us mm. with the records. Yeah. We had lyricists. Yeah. They have sound man uh -huh. quality. Come and try and battle us with record for record, yeah. Yes, sir. How are you? Bloody hell. 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 They are sick at it. And we was in North, in Ali Pali. Of course they're going to win. Yeah. Not saying they didn't deserve to win because they were yeah. fucking on fire. Yeah. Even I was like, ooh. I remember that tape. Remember that tape? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that tape. 
was it? sick. And that was, that was it. Was it one of them said, you got no weed, no you know gas. Yeah. Come for see and in a no weed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Jackson. Yeah. You don't know about that. They don't know about like, history. Can I tell you something, Chris? History. Chris, at that point. <laughs> this was the best time, you know. Chris, this had... was the turning of black music. You don't even know about history. Yo, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say something? Give him a drink. Can I say? <laughs> at that point, I, guy, I, I had three children and responsibilities, like, a, like an adult. Was you really that old? Yeah, yeah. as an adult. Uh, I'm sorry you weren't there. <laughs> it was like a tortoise so, without so a shell. <laughs> You did, you missed out. You, you missed, missed out. out. Good times, bro. No, you know what I'm... How about you? Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. We don't need to talk about age fucking about. I'm 44, I'm 45. Right, so I'm five years older than you. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not that bad. So, is it bad? <laughs> 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 oh, oh shit. <laughs> like, you only five. Good, don't don't no do that, Lisa. Lance, no, you, you, you got no... Where's your lines? Is your good? You when, got no room. When I said it, your first instinct was what you thought. <laughs> when I said, I'm five years old, you're like this. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but it wasn't a bad... That's only not a bad five. Thing. <laughs> yeah, but, but... No. <laughs> I'm not saying... I'm saying <laughs> <laughs> you're making it all bad now. I wasn't saying that. Like, you look good, man. You're so, good. No, so, basically... I had three kids by the time I was 24, You're too 25. Nasty, huh? So that's what no, I'm saying. You're too nasty, no, no, with the well, same baby woman. Mama. One big oh, mother. Oh, I'm yeah, not, thank you. Baby. I'm not like no, but who the fuck the same name? But who the fuck does that? That's my like, stuff. I don't. He got on like he was making so much money. He was adopted. <laughs> He was then adulting. Then I make him fucking selling TV out the back of the car, wasn't it? Did that tell you all that the club watching Mega Man get fucking yeah, shit? Yeah, yeah. Get high, yeah, I'm a dying. I wasn't even inside, I was outside yeah. in the front door. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and responsibilities back then. Uh, oh, man. How have you found it? Have you had, did you have any more kids after? No. Is it? I think... I think what I noticed from, because I had her so young, I'm so glad I had her because I didn't have time otherwise to have any kids. Yeah. And as you get older, obviously I was a kid having a kid, but mm. as you got, and I grew up very quick because of it, mm. but I also realised that it would be complete neglect to have a child While you're with that sort of career. Yeah, 100%. Because it took me Smart, away from her. Girl. And at the very beginning, mm. it was heartbreaking and I just got used to it. Yeah. of not having my daughter around whilst I tour, whilst I relaxed as well, because there were times I'd come off a tour and I'm just exhausted. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, this is no place for my daughter to be because I'd be in my bed sleeping yeah, and she'd yeah. be like, I'm hungry. I'd be like, yeah. the hell we want me to know where <laughs> So who took care of your daughter My then? mom. Oh, good. Amazing. My mom. My, my daughter's oh. not happy about it, though. She's like, that was dead. That was <laughs> <laughs> dead. Like, <laughs> she hates me. She hates me for Every it. Every week she's making nocky. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we're making it homemade, the one. <laughs> She's still pissed at me today for so leaving her. How old is your daughter now? She's 27. Wow. Yeah. Oh, no, let me show. just announce her. Wait, let me fix my tits to make sure I look good, yeah? <laughs> Uncle Percy, is that right? <laughs> so I have a four year old grandson. Really? Hey. Congratulations, man. Oh, well on you. Hey. Well on oh, hey. hey. you. I have no. <laughs> I have no shame in it. I'm so That's proud amazing. of it. That's amazing. You know why I'm so proud of it? Because I am so glad now that I had her so young because I'm getting every piece of him. And yeah. I'm, you know, like I'm really able to enjoy. Energy. I can play football. I can go park. I can climb, climb everything. it right about, you know, climb amazing. and frame, everything. I can do everything with him. And I'm so glad I can be part of that journey and still have my career and but be more in control. Can know? I just say something to you, though, Lisa, yeah? Yes, I'm sir. Gonna, I'm going to be at 100, yeah? Yeah. You see how I love this generation, brother. Yeah. You see, imagine <laughs> granny. Remember my granny from back in the day? No, do you know how do you know how amazing it is that you're yeah. for her to be able to have her grandchild as if it's her child. So yeah, you've got the same. Do you know what? Yeah. That's yeah. What, you know what? I'm not gonna lie, you know. Yeah. It's it's so beautiful because I look back to when my gran was like your age. Yeah. She was using a piss pad back then. <laughs> <laughs> That's what right. I used back then. I had to check the calendar because I checked, I said, she was 43. I checked the piss pad <laughs> under her bed. 
with rusty piss as well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> The piss look like, you know when you bleed the radiator in the old yard? <laughs> Lisa, don't laugh with them. <laughs> don't laugh with them. Listen, listen, listen. 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 Listen, Listen, Lisa, don't tell me when you're going to Remember when they used to, you, him, remember you used to go to the toilet and someone had already pitted it and never flush it? And you go there and you go in and you go, <laughs> <laughs> Lisa, come on, stop it. It's not funny. <laughs> no, no, that's the piss that. That's yeah. the piss my granny was doing, and you're took, and you're a granny now. Yeah. Look at this. I know. My piss don't stink like that. I don't know what happened. But you're your granny. granny. Well, to your granny? Why you never look after Listen, your granny? No, but oh. that's what happened to you. Listen, old school Jamaica granny. Yeah. They Different. used to. They were. They, they, were they, they used to think that their food was healthy. Jamaica food ain't healthy. It's greasy. It's, greasy. it's, it's, it's not. It's, it's greasy. Oh. It's too much salt. Mm. It's too much sugar. My grand, my great grand used to put sugar on her salad. Imagine really? this. <laughs> on her lettuce. Oh, on her lettuce leaf. Special. And not brown sugar, you know. The le- tight and lay one. The, ch- wow. the whole packet of. You ever see them make poor me castle? Better bare sugar. 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 You're right, Uncle Pedro. It's for sugars on everything. They yeah. put sugar in everything, yeah. brother. And terrible, isn't it? It's terrible, and but it's only now. Obviously, now we know about health now. Yeah, yeah but go to real. Ja- that's now. here though. That's go this. to real Jamaica. My auntie, I have an auntie called Coolie Girl. Okay. She's 103, still stomping up and down your lane. Except she's not classy. Oh, no. Listen to me. Let me tell you something, right? That's what I'm about. That's what I'm about. Listen to me, right? Yes, I'm going to You see, up in the hills. Yes. We don't use so much powder seasoning, no. right? Mm-hmm. We use natural vegetables for seasoning with food. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Natural. Thyme, meat. skellion, and all them things there. Mm-hmm. You see certain places, if you see the amount of powder with them put on the jam, so yeah. too much. That's yeah. why a lot of black people have diabetes yeah. and all them things. High blood pressure. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, you're right, because I'll be honest with you. Remember, you know, I grew up here. So I'm the, I was, my uncles, my, my parents were born in Jamaica, but my mm. uncles, who they, their siblings, their younger siblings, were born mm. here. Mm. So I was the first generation after them to be born here. So mm. all of my Jamaica side is from here. So yeah. they, I grew up very westernized. Very westernized. Yeah. Do you understand? Yeah. So yeah. The, all of the sugar thing and all of that, that's, that's what we grew mm. up on. My, gran, my grand's cornmeal porridge was sick. <laughs> my brother, <laughs> brother you can have two bones, four teas of her. <laughs> <laughs> That's a whole yeah. I think I the new fetish. What's what? that? Well, Lisa told me she's a grandma. I was like, oh, oh for fuck's sake. Now you've got a stool cut out because you're granny. Just can't no, look at where I start. No, look at where I start. No. Granny. Hey, wait, call me. I'm here. Okay. Oh, sorry. Let me get some more of this. Yes, Jules, Jules. You're beautiful, Granny. <laughs> you like the mix, don't you? I did. It's uh, amazing. That's a beautiful you comedy, Ashan. This yeah, is a really sorry. good combination. <laughs> Can you please stop? I'm going to see. You're getting bossy. Percy's blushing. Jesus. Oh, man. No, no, but it's, do you know what, though? I'll be honest. I just feel as if. This country, our journey in this country has been such a unique experience as okay, well. Okay, it's our black people, young, but, our generation. But young, which... uh, like young from the streets. Yes. Mm. And especially of colour. Yes. It's like our journey has just been, because we're the first to experience certain things as well. Like you guys, and this is why I have to big you up, because you look were the first to show, bro, do you know what? You can be from the road. You can speak like a certain way. You can look a certain mm. way and still make it. Mm. And so from there to now, what's your take on music now? Yeah, fucked, isn't it? Do you know what? Do you know what? I give thanks mainly for that we grew up without the age of uh, social media mm-hmm. because we had to graft. That's right. We'd, it yeah. was like a real job Press still. Right. Let me yeah. tell you. Yeah, yeah. I'm, not, I'm not actually saying they haven't done well because there are... They are the pinnacles of, you know, of music industry now, Stormzy, yeah, yeah. Dave. Yeah. There's plenty. For you guys. Steph London, wanna... Miss Banks. There's plenty yeah, yeah. showing that now they stall of promotion and musicians work. Mm. 
Yeah. But them pussy clad didn't know what it take to... That graph. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm telling you. And yeah, yeah, the, yeah, the worst yeah. thing they is, don't I don't know. feel that they pay enough homage to you lot. No, they do. Do you think that they no, do? I have to, no, I have oh, to take well, that. Well, I, maybe for your Chip has always sung our praises. Mm. There's plenty of, I'm you know, gonna... that era. Mm. But then saying that, that is the older era. Even Chip's the Chip's older quite, era. Yeah, 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 Chip's the older now. It's the new guys. All right, so... Okay. But no, back row G. Back row G. I love he's back row just G. come through and he's rated the whole okay, Oxford okay. Chino thing, the garage thing. He's they, at Crept and Conan. They've kind of rated they've the whole garage scene. In. Oh, that's yeah, mm. but then they are associated with the garage scene, either family or whatever. That's so what, yeah, so that's, that's where it's come yeah, from. Yeah. But the new new ones, they have no respect. Yeah. Well, well, that's, <laughs> that's, yeah. That's what I was going to ask you as well. Yeah. Um, you guys were a part of the house and garage scene, yeah? But your music wasn't your typical, I give you flowers. No. Chocolate because boy. we grew up. What was your music classed as then? Is it still house and garage? We were what? the early day grime. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. yeah. So you if you were, think about yeah, it. Yeah, you were the... Ba the think about it. We fathers. were the underground garage. Yes. We weren't Craig David. We weren't Sweet FA. That's we weren't right. Kelly LaRock. We weren't Charlotte Amma. Mm -hmm. We weren't Craig David. We were so solid. We were the so solid sound. Yes. So we are classed as... Before Graham, yeah. we were the So Solid sound. It wasn't even Garage, it was So Solid that's sound. That's true, you know. Proper unique. That's yeah, it was unique. That's true, that's true. Because we, 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 we <laughs> had, that's true, that's yeah, true. we had full creative control. We said, as it goes, all lot of artists now, they, and even back then, their label took over. We had full creative control. They trusted Sick. us and let us run. You know, wow. that's why we was able to maintain and our sound. And sound your sound, yeah. Yeah. And so when we important. came through a mega, mega Man up first, in one second, oh shit, they, <laughs> you forget why I was able to say that? Hey, you get me? Soldier. Yeah. Oh, hey, uh, in a black yeah. Fuck off. Yeah, family. You know, you know, Chris is excited when he's showing all his 32 teeth. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, listen, guys. Um, thank you, Lisa, for coming down. I, I appreciate love you, you guys. coming down. Thank you for having Big up me. Big Lisa, man. Uh, <laughs> yeah. no. Make sure you drink that mafia rum, you know. 100%. <laughs> oh, yeah, make sure. Hold oh, on, no, let me give the tea again. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you see how strong it is? It's mashed him up. See, there you nah, go. Mafia <laughs> rum. Bless, man. <laughs> it, it tastes good, though, I must say. God bless you. Good. Mix of Percy Juice. Respect. Love respect, you. Respect. Thank yes, you, Uncle Percy. Thank you so much. 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 Big up Christopher Savage. I know the thing. Big up Uncle Percy. You shut up your mouth, man. <laughs> Big up the one and only Lisa Mafia. <laughs> Lisa Mafia. Mafia. Remember, I told you I'm a soldier. Hey. Fuck off. Oh. <laughs> I'm a groupie. <laughs>